Hey guys, so in this video I want to show you how I'm fixing a problem with a PDF document that I have here on my Mac that I was editing on my Mac, uh, which got suddenly password protected. And uh, so I was editing this um, document here with preview. Uh, the same issue can also uh, occur when you're using uh, Safari, the Safari browser. So I was editing this video, uh, this PDF file, and then when I was saving it, then suddenly um, Preview decided to put a password on this document. So the next time I was trying to open the document, uh, I literally didn't have a way to open this because you can see here it's asking you to enter a password. Of course, I don't have that password. And uh, it's not your user, like the yeah, password of your user account on your Mac. It's nothing, anything like that, no zeros or password. So eventually uh, there's no way to open up this document again on of course this is a major problem if you're filling out some form and you don't want to do it all over again and uh, so now the way that we fix this problem that i'm fixing this is first i'm going to open here terminal so i'm going to open the terminal application and then with the help of this we are going to able to repair the file so the pdf file is actually broken and there's no real password on it so we just have to fix this file and uh, in order to make sure in, in case something goes wrong uh, in this process I'm actually going to make a backup copy, copy of my file here so just in case the uh, file that we're working on is going to be corrupted or disappears for some reason I'm going to have a backup copy so now that we have created this backup copy I'm going back to terminal and here the uh, first thing we're going to do is we're going to change into the folder uh, that our document is located at. And we do this here by typing in cd and then space dot slash and now the folder that the uh, file is located at. In this case, this is here downloads and forward slash PDF issue. And I'm going to press enter and then here we can type in ls just to confirm that we're really in the right folder because now we should be able to see our file name. So next we're going to take a look here at the bottom of the video when we find this one single command here. It's quite a long command and I'm going to copy paste this here also into the video description so you can copy it right straight from there. And we're going to first make a small adjustment here in the last line where you see here the path to my file, my PDF file, and in this case we're going to just shorten this line here to the file name of our corrupted or password protected PDF document because we're already in that folder in the terminal. So I'm just going to call change this line here to my locked file dot PDF. Now I'm going to copy this entire command here. I'm going to copy everything. So we can see it here, command C and then command V this into the terminal window. Just making sure, double checking that everything looks right. And then all we have to do is press enter. And then if you take a look at the preview here in the in the finder menu window, then you see you have seen that this uh, preview I can already changed from the lock symbol to our actual file, to our PDF file. So this means that we can now open up our PDF document again without having to enter a password. Okay, so I hope that this video was helpful. If you have any more questions or comments, then please leave a message below. And if you liked the video, then please give me a thumbs up.